Oh, iRacing, how I've missed you so, so much.
What is up, guys? Thank you so much for joining today's stream. Really appreciate it. Today, we're going to be streaming ourselves some good old iRacing. There we go. And, uh, yeah. Uh, let me just make sure that my settings are all accounted for. Nope, they're not. Okay. So, I'm going to have to do some quick uh, adjustments real quick. Just give me a second. I was messing around with the mouse settings because... I didn't have my wheel plugged in, and, uh, yeah. So let me go ahead and just fix the settings real quick. All right, so here we go. Let's go ahead and get settled now. I'll be right back. <laughs> the same need for speed. All right, so here's the thing. This is my first time on iRacing on this channel. I used to do a lot of iRacing. I want to mention one thing real quick. These types of streams are obviously going to be much different. They're a bit more serious. So in terms of commentary and in terms of like interaction, there will be a lot less interaction with you guys. Because obviously I'm trying to be competitive, trying to win, you know. But this is my first day back on iRacing, legitly, not counting like fun races, in almost a year. So I'm going to be really rusty here. And what's up, Abstract? What's up, Ramon? So yeah, there's not going to be much interaction on my end, but, you know, I am doing iRacing. So yeah, less racing, obviously, of course. So it won't be as, you know, it won't be as fun and like jokey as the other streams. But yeah, you know. I did some practice here at Charlotte. I, I'm obviously going to talk to you guys during these inter these intermissions and stuff. So, yeah. Let's see who we're racing with, first of all. Holy shit. I think we have a 20-car field. Any noticeable drivers here? No, sadly not. We're not racing against any real people. But, yeah. Check your flag is out for practice. And uh, let's go qualifying at Charlotte Motor Speedway. I'll be muting my mic as well, by the way, during races. I have hotkeys for that, you know. One more lap. 
Ah, I seriously screwed up my qualifying run badly. Like, turns one and two, I felt like I was really fast through, but three and four, not so much. Damn it. Okay, well, let's take a look at our qualifying run. Why not? I gotta get the rust off, guys. Like, I'm really rusty when it comes to eye racing. Like, literally, this is my first race in almost a year. I haven't done any practice races. I've only done practice laps, but that was my first qualifying run with this car at Charlotte. I've never raced at Charlotte with the, the K&N car before. See, I was way too close to the wall coming out of into turn one. But it wasn't that bad. Exit was good out of T2. Exit was good out of turn two. Um, yeah, I just got a little bit too washed up coming out of three and four. So, like, yeah, I just had to lift. Because I knew I was going to scrape the wall if I did not lift. And, uh, yeah. Yeah, you know. Unfortunately, we can't watch anyone else's qualifying runs because, you know, oval qualifying. We have a minute 25 until the race starts. I'm currently 6th place, which, you know what, that's not bad. It is a bit tight, yeah. <laughs> Rusties helps the rust. But, um, yeah, I mean... <laughs> Ka-chow. Um... Yeah, I mean, I, I'm, uh, it, it is a bit tight. Like, my buddy, my buddy LC Racing 92 who, by the way, you can find him on Twitch, LC Racing, that's L as in Lion, C as in Cat, Racing 92, uh, was telling me that the tires fall off quickly here at Charlotte with these K&N cars. So that's something we're going to have to manage, tire management and all that good stuff. We have a field of 20 cars, 20 plus cars. 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. We have 22 people in the field. Which, this is unrealistic. K&N. LC's on Twitch? Yeah, he is. He doesn't quite stream enough iRacing. He streams like... He's trying to get a new PC build so he can start streaming. Like, iRacing and stuff. All he does is like, Rocket League for now. And the occasional COD and Battlefield streams. But I don't think he has any equipment for like, streaming and stuff. Okay, P6, you know what? Thank you, Marvin, for posting the link. P6 on my first qualifying back, you know, after so long. Hey, I'll take it. All right, guys, here we go. Actually, let me let me go ahead and do something real quick. How much time do I have? I have a minute and 44. That's perfect, perfect amount of time. Uh, let's see here. Oh, no, no, it's under sound. That's right. Enable voice chat, playback. No, microphone. Blue snowball. Push to talk. X. Good luck, everyone. One left to green. Line up on the outside. Bit road is closed. Good luck. I'm a bit nervous. I gotta be honest with you guys. I'm a bit nervous. It's been so long. Actually, I'm not going to mute my mic because push to talk. Actually, not push to talk, but um, in case I have, to, in case anyone talks to me on the on the open chat. So uh, yeah. 
But like I said, I'm not gonna do a lot of like commentary. I'm not here to put on a show for you. Well, I'm here to put on a show, but not like an entertaining, super entertaining, Need for Speed style racing, memes, all that stuff. It's, this isn't really that kind of thing, you know? And it's the same kind of approach I want to take with my GT Sports streams as well. Like, I gotta focus on actually trying to get good instead of just trying to be cool and stuff. You know, just, these are online competitive races. You know, so, gotta find that balance, you know what I mean? By the way, the resolution's kind of weird, and everything's kind of, like, pushed together, like, the relative and everything, because, unfortunately, my second monitor is... We got action. My second monitor is actually a freaking 720p TV, so the resolution is much less on my TV. Catch the 17, cop. Alright, here we go, guys. I'll shut up now. Catch the seventeen, cops. Holy shit, I'm I'm really nervous. <laughs> All right, I think once we take the green flag, I think we'll be good. So, what's the goal for this race? Survive. I'll take a top five. Obviously, I want to go for a win, but if we finish in the top five, I'll be really happy. Get ready. Going green. The pace car is in. Green, green, green! 35 laps of Charlotte, here we go! See a puff of smoke. Oh, someone spun? No, it, those are wreck in the back markers, I think. So I'm trying to be calm here, like. You know, we're. Uh, the top four is starting to pull away from the rest of the field, which is awesome. Fifth place is about a second behind us. S sixth place, two seconds, and which is a lot at Charlotte. And uh, I'm trying to watch the tires. I'm not trying to push too hard. Like, I'm trying to make moves when I can. I'm not trying to force the issue.
bit's high out of exit, god damn it. What are you doing, 21? Hey, 21, get out the way, bro, come on. What Saved it. Saved it. Okay, top line is not good. I think number 17 is out of tires, maybe. He's like starting to get really slow out of the corners. Oh. Damn it. Damn it, damn it. Uh. You've got wheel damage. That car's a lap down. That car's a lap down. Your car is too much damage. We've got to fix it. That's that all on me, guys. I'm down. really sorry. That happens. Don't worry about it. Fuck. No, that was deliberate, man. It took me out deliberately. You're in the top ten. Oh, am I? Goody. Whatever, I, I killed my crew. Whatever. Too far left. Oh, god damn it. Yeah, just let him do repair. I mean, you know what? It's it's all it's all a learning process. All learning process. Okay, punch it. You know what? We we go back out and we just um, log more laps, I guess, under race conditions. Oh shit! You guys saw the mirror? series that doesn't have cautions. If it had cautions, we probably would have a chance still to maybe come back, but at this point, you know, we're just going to go and um, just try to focus on just logging some laps in. That's all we can do. the white line or not. I might have. after the race is over. Be like, holy shit, you're right. Another position gained. Seven. Oh, another position gained. All right. Cool. Okay, so that guy's in third. Don't want to. Okay, he's going slow. Outside. 
so we'll just get around. Oh yeah. I want to say we're like two laps down. Let's check. Yep, we're two laps down. There's only three cars on the lead lap. We could finish up to fourth, maybe. But the leaders could wreck. Maybe we could have been a lap down if I didn't screw up my pit entry, but the entire left front, the entire left front tire was like unresponsive. I think it was like smushed in, so nothing we can do about that. That's why I struggled so much to get into the pit box. That's going to be the key to victory, I suppose. Just extreme tire management. Because, like I said, third place, fourth place, all these guys were going really slow. So the leader is probably just cruising. He's probably just going to cruise to victory. While the guys behind him are probably going to try to push harder and uh, they're going to face the consequence. Go outside, 19. Three, two, car outside, clear outside. That car's a lap down. Yeah, he's a lap down, but he's way faster than I am right now. That's gonna seal sixth place for us at the at the very worst. I think. So my brother just walked in. Two laps down. Just trying to get some 
efficiently with no trouble. But you know what, as long as I finish where I started, sixth place, I'm cool with this result. Top five was the goal, but you know, um I uh I'll I'll be okay with this result. It's only it's the first race in over a year. And I'm talking about like a legit race with like you know, um, contact, you know, the 4X is on and everything, and qualifying, well, qualifying goes into the fun races too, but, like, SR, IR, and everything added in. So you have to be a little bit more serious, put Game Face on, and, uh, yeah. Got five laps to go, technically two. For those who are new to the channel, got two laps to go. Uh, yeah, I know it's two laps to go. Um, for those who are new to the channel, my oval racing game is really weak. So I'm not the best oval racer out there. So I feel like starting with the national series at KNN and trying to work our way up to Cup, to, even though I have that license to race in the Cup Series level, starting at KNN I think would be the best. Kind of like a NASCAR journey, I suppose, trying to get good at oval racing. This is not my forte at all. You just got the white flag. That means one more lap to go. Alright, just one more lap. Just keep it clean. Come on. No, don't tell me the leader got wrecked. Oh, never mind. I was gonna say, if the leader got wrecked, man. Hey, sixth place finish. You know what? I'll take it. All right, there's the ticket flag. Great job. You did really well. Thank you, coach. Congrats, Andres. You're the smartest one out of all of us. Holy shit! Thank you, Bar. <laughs> <waiting> with you. 
It really came down to that. Good way. He definitely was the smartest one out of all of us. Stay out of trouble, kept the tires in check. And you know what? Good way, Sandra. We didn't win. But who cares? You know what? I'm gonna Thank you, Joel. I'm gonna join like Andres. Over. Bring it on in. Because this is my first race back on iRacing. In over a year. So let's celebrate the fact that I'm back on the service. I'm doing donuts because I it's my first year back on iRacing, so <laughs> I've been gone for a year, so I'm celebrating that fact. Okay, I don't think anyone gives a fuck, which they don't. Look at that. The good old TC racing car. PSN just went down. Oh see. Okay. Now the race is over, let's look at the chat. What's up, Medic? What's up, Arthur? Yeah, Plep King. This, dude, this series is really ruthless. Let's go back to the accident. Let's see what happened. You saw me throwing that turtle shell. <laughs> Shh. Don't tell the officials, bro. Look, I touched the apron slightly. I slightly went down on the apron, like, just on the white line. And I tried to go back up a little bit too soon. <sighs> Took out two guys with me. Damn. But you know what? Like I said, it's a learning experience. So... When is the next race? How does it feel with the TGT? Oh, awesome, dude. I, I think the TGT, I'm surprised. Oh, yeah, the apron is not part of the racetrack. <laughs> oh, man. Too bad other people won't get that joke. Okay. Oof. The next race is at 1.45 my time, so that means an hour and 30 minutes from now. So... Nothing flex tape can't fix. I know, right? We need to bust out the flex tape. So, what we're going to do in the meantime is we're going to do some of the fun races that don't count towards SR and IR. Meaning, we're going to do the Pickup Cup and we're going to do the Delara Dash. So, Pickup Cup is at Phoenix this weekend, or this week. And Delara Dash is at Laguna Seca. Ooh, okay. So, Pickup Cup is basically the old NASCAR Camping World Truck Series trucks from, like, 2013. Just used for a fun league because it's free content. And it's at Phoenix 2008, which is free content because it's the old version of Phoenix. And then Delara Dash is a series that uses the old IndyCar chassis. So, 2011 and 2012 IndyCar chassis. And they run at all the free tracks. Because it's just a fun series for anyone to join, basically. That's the whole gist of it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to join the practice session for the pickup cup. We're most likely going to die in the race, but hey, you know what? We can do this to kill some time. Because we have, like I said, an hour and 30 before the next K&N race. So let's do the pickup cup. The fact that you crashed and came back in six is like Arca material. Then well, these are K and N cars, and we're racing at a at a speedway. So in a sense, this is like an Arca race. You know, everyone is talentless, including myself. And yeah, you know, like now nah, I'm, I'm kidding about the talentless part. There are some talent in Arca, but you know, I, I had a I had a friend who used to do PR and photography for Mason Mitchell Motorsports in Arca, and yeah, like. 
when he was telling me about Natalie Decker, like Natalie Decker was the, was like one of like what five or six full time drivers, and I'm talking about full time, like every single race, and she finished last, like she finished like sixth or seventh, which is basically dead last for like full time ARCA entries. Which uh, it's basically just a ride buyer series, you know, in a sense. I mean, racing is pretty much ride buying in general, but ARCA especially. K and N especially is a freaking ride buyer series. Oh my god, I just realized what I'm driving right now. Guys, I just realized what the hell I'm driving right now. Let me show you. <laughs> Ta da! Oh my god! I forgot all about this! I'm driving the Marvin the Gamer 27 truck. Hey, so look, I'm promoting my YouTube channel through my through my livery. I'll do the same. Make some enemies? Okay. Fudge. <laughs> Was that a good Marvin impersonation? No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding, Marvin. I love you. Don't hurt me. No YouTube feuds. Outside. <laughs> You're calling me a sellout, Maddie. Outside. <laughs> no, you. practice by the way guys the official lobby is going to open up at 12 30. you got a content id this a black world right no balls i dare you <laughs> oh my god i just me by me saying that i basically just challenged marvin to actually content block me is this copying Rhino? Uh, yeah. I, I mean, I'm just a Rhino GT4 ripoff after all. Cast off down low. Go high. 29.462. Inside. I mean, you know, him and I, you know, I, I, I so happened to do a Need for Speed Underground 2 playthrough at the same time he did a Need for Speed Underground 2 playthrough. It's not like, you know, I announced it many months in advance and I saw that come. We've got big problems with that engine. Okay. Um, yeah, it's, it's not like I so happened to, you know, announce what I'm doing Underground 2, like, months in advance, and he so happened to just do it because he doesn't watch my channel, you know. It's nothing like that, you know, I, I just... I know, I'm, I'm copying his roll tactic. <laughs> this session is a joke. Yo. Car inside. Clear. Cast off. Down I high. would practice that Charlotte with the K and N. Oh my God! What the hell just happened? Car inside. Twenty. Problems on pit road. Clear inside. Contact! Problems for the 27! 
Marvin Moreno. Problems on the racetrack. Jesus Christ, dude. Like, this is a practice session, and yet these guys are just Come wrecking each other. Hmm, what is sportsmanship? Oh, okay. He got towed. Be a missile. <laughs> Car inside. Clear. Twenty nine point one eight seven. Slow car down low. That was on purpose. No, I'm kidding. I got a text message from Elsie Racing, actually. You know what? Screw this. Screw the. Hang on. Damn. So, hey, Marvin, NASA's at um, NASA's at Willow Springs again this year, and they're at Auto Club too. Whoa. <laughs> Somebody hey, that's like, pretty cool, dude. Turn right into me. <laughs> also, I'm streaming the Charlotte National Race. And you're right about the tires falling off. Ha ha ha. Message sent. practice and it's a fun race it doesn't count for SRIR so you know to my YouTube channel, which we're live now, youtube.com, movie chicane, then, uh, yeah, I'll, I'll take your link. <laughs> what? what the hell is he trying to do? Like, send us to a... Is he, try, is he trying to freaking take us to a Christian worship page?
Okay. <laughs> I don't know why he was trying to solicit us with <laughs> freaking Christian worship pages, but hey, whatever. If he's gonna solicit us for that, I'll just, you know, beg for him to subscribe to our channel. Which, by the way, guys, if you're joining the stream, if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. Can we get to 300 subscribers before 2019? Almost there. Thinking emoji. But yeah, the salt in this fucking lobby is incredible. Like, these guys are really getting this mad over a fun race. Like, come on. Just spam links in the chat. No, thank you. <laughs> Salt. More like pure sodium. Oh my god, number six is spun out. Reporting him. I'm gonna file a protest. Because he spun out on accident. Yeah, guys, we're racing for Jesus. Hashtag Racers for Christ. By the way, that's a real team, by the way. Racers for Christ. If you mind using the curb, you can get a free spin into the wall. Oh, really? I'll try that right now. All right, let's get on the curb. Spin into the wall. Hey, it worked! Thanks for the maxi gaming. One lap equals one day closer to second coming. Courtesy of NASCAR Thunder 2004. <laughs> Hey, what's up, uh, Gus? Ricers for Christ. Uh, hey, Marvin, I think Haley Deegan's part of that Ricers for Christ team. Alright, alright, now it's time for qualifying. Y'all mind if I praise the Lord? Can we get some prayer hands and emoji in, in chat, please? Alright, I'm gonna shut up now because it's qualifying. Green flag, green flag. My pop filter fell okay, off. Okay, here comes your first time black. Over. Alright, where do we qualify? Second place! That's not bad! Okay. Not bad! Alright. God damn it. Stupid pop filter. Stay on. Thank you, Jesus Christ, my Lord and Savior. 
for this and thank you lord for this p2 <laughs> please i'll have every other racer burn in hell for eternity because they're all sinners and they don't something uh ezekiel 23 37 54 45 however the hell they cite their quotes or whatever amen <laughs> i don't i don't even know what the fuck i'm doing here we don't race to win we race to see the love for christ <laughs> oh my god you want to make this a video <laughs> me too No, thank you. Scam likely, my iPhone says. Nah. Okay, LC Racing just got back to me. He says, you have to be really easy with rolling back on the throttle, sometimes passing corner apex. So I'm going to tell him, 10-4, bud. Thank you. Take it to Gatorade Victory Lane. I'll try. We're starting second. <laughs> Introducing a priest as the flagman. No, they're not. All right, so we qualified second. Cool. Just one lap to green. Line up on the outside. Bit road is closed. All right, good luck, everyone. I like how that guy says clean race, please, knowing that that's not going to be what happens. House of Pain truck versus Marvin the Gamer truck. Get ready, going green. Don't All right. pass the O3 car. Don't pass the O3 car. He's like he's behind me. Pace car is in. Green, green, green. Pit road is now open. 25 laps of Phoenix. Green, green, green.
Hi, wide and handsome. Somehow we kept him away. Holy shit. Kidding me? No. <laughs> God damn it. Ah, <laughs> we were doing so well. What happened? Looked to me like second place got taken out. No, I was behind second place, and he hit the wall and came back down into me. But it's all good. I mean, nothing I could do. You know, the... The Marvin the Gamer 27 boys did a good job with the truck today. Unfortunately, we just had some really bad luck coming out of turn number two. And, uh, yeah, I just feel bad for all the guys back at the shop in, in Charlotte. The shame. I want to thank Marvin the Gamer, Elgato, Gran Turismo, Astro Gaming, and uh, I know I'm forgetting other sponsors too. It's Chevy. Yeah, there we go. Go. Oh, whatever. We'll, we'll keep going. Interview over. Got a jet. Outside. Clear outside. Oh, yes. I want to thank Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior, as well. I want to thank God. I want to thank Mary. I want to thank. Uh, Allah, I want to thank Buddha, I want to thank uh, Lord Zenu and other people, I don't know. You know, at least this race doesn't affect SR or IR, so I don't really care, to be honest. Down. 
Alright, Rishi, see you later, man. Thanks for stopping by. Oh, yeah, it's a spaghetti monster as well. I Holy shit, that guy is really slow. Car inside. Taking the Larson line. Stay high. Car stop down low. Clear inside. Go high. Don't go forward 23 for the love of God. That guy has a more motor. He's just picking up smoke everywhere. Dude, go away. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Car inside. Clear. Somebody else has a blow motor too. Like, I could pass the leader if I wanted to, but, eh, no, I, I don't want to be that guy. The leader's taking it easy, like, like I said, I'll pass him when, same thing as the Charlotte race, my intention at first is pass when you can, when it's like the most easiest and convenient time to pass Oh my god, dude, that sixth place car. That guy is a literal definition of a moving Clear chicane. Inside. Clear inside. God damn it. Twenty nine point two four nine. I'm here, Marvin.
28.843. Damn, that guy's sponsored by the state of Pennsylvania. That's what's up. Outside. Keep low. Clear. Eight point nine seven four. You got two laps to go. White flag, one more left to go. Twenty nine point zero one. There's the checkered flag. Great job, you did really well. Nice job, Danny. Thank you, Claire. <laughs> Your car is smoking. You've got wheel damage. I think I do have damage. Sorry, I wasn't paying attention. You guys you guys touched and then you spawned and then I didn't see you. Race was over anyway, so. Again, my bad. <laughs> All right, well, that's it for Pickup Cup. We still have another half an hour until the next uh, Charlotte race. So next up is Delara Dash while we wait. You think I might have damage? Eh, no, the car's fine. I don't know what you're talking about. And Mazda Raceway Laguna Seca is where this race is at. WeatherTech Raceway, I'm sorry. WeatherTech Raceway Laguna Seca. WeatherTech Mazda... Uh... Uh, Toyota, Laguna Seca, GP, whatever. I don't think I have a custom livery for this car. Again, this is another fun series, so yeah. No SR or IR involved. The one thing that actually sucks about the National Series is that the races are way too short. To have such a huge gap in time, like, like one hour or literally two hours between races is way too long. One hour would have been good. So yeah, I'm using the Delara DW12 for this one. You can use the IR11 or the DW12, but the DW12 is a much better car. Better than the crap wagon. I have to buy the IR18. I really want to use that car. Twenty-five registered. Okay, not bad. Who's running the DW12? Everyone, IR11. Only a few people. See, do I have a custom scheme? I do. Okay. 
I have a, uh... No, I'm kidding. There's no other channel I'm sponsoring, I guess. Or sponsored by me. Or being sponsored here. I think this one's an actual IndyCar livery. Yep, it is. The good old Elio Castro Nevis livery. Break earlier. That was real smart of him. That was real smart of that guy. <laughs> he should have just stayed in place. That's how I stayed in place, and that guy still hit me.
Alright, so race lobby is being loaded right now. Hey Evan, I'm doing great. You're in yourself. Okay, how many people are in here? Uh, I want to say like 15. Hey, I was right, 15. And it's like a split field. Almost evenly split between the DW12s and the IR11s. All right, time for qualifying. Flag, green flag. Okay, here comes your first time black. Okay, I broke a little too early. God damn it, I got a one off. One more lap. The lap's not going to count.
cut the course. You'll have to slow down and give up the time. You know, what, third is not bad, considering the fact that I haven't practiced at all with the DW12 in a very long time. Fourth, fifth, whatever. I'll, I'll, you know what? This race is just supposed to be like I had absolutely no practice with the DW12 and Laguna at all. Unlike. Hey, T-Ball, no Baxi Gaming. But yeah, um, I haven't practiced at all here with this car in a very long time. So you know what? Fuck it. Um, fifth place, that's not bad. Not great, but... Eh, no. Yeah, they, they, they definitely... I think they might have changed. Yeah, and... Um, the, that's the rules of the chat, buddy. One lap to green. Line up on the left side. Bit road is closed. Okay, I, I I completely expect to die here. <laughs> Whatever. I mean, you know what? Like, it's a fun race. Who cares? They might have changed the the brakes on this car, or like the tire, like 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 the tire model or something. Who knows? I can't tell because it's been so long. Or maybe they didn't. I'm just that rusty with the indie cars at this in this game. I like how that guy's weaving behind us, like... Like, yeah, I weave too, but I only weave when I'm doing qualifying. I don't weave during the formation lap just because, like, I don't want to risk hitting anyone. Like, look, look how close this guy is. And nobody... What the hell just happened behind me? See, the guys behind me were weaving, and they took someone out. 